Hi peeps, welcome back to my channel. Sorry about the surroundings again. It is, it is so hard to find somewhere to film a good video. There, we've had the ceilings pulled down last night. Everywhere is a complete mess. Around me is kitchen cutlery, bowls, plates, an actual kitchen, some clothes on a clothes horse, and a dishwasher. It is chaotic, but I am still trying to sit down and film a video, so I hope you enjoy it. I am going to do the autumn tag that's been going around. I've just watched Charlotte Taylor's and Mama Izzo's and thought, what a lovely tag, I'll join in. So I've written the questions down on a piece of paper here. Um, question one, what is your favourite autumn lip colour? Now mine is the Charlotte Tilbury uh, Mac Revolution in Glastonbury. It's an absolutely gorgeous uh, dark berry gothic kind of lip colour and this is amazing throughout autumn and winter. You can't go wrong with the casing as well. A beautiful rose gold. Question two, what is your favourite nail autumn nail polish? Now mine for the last few years is uh, the Gelish Hello Merlot. I do my own gel nails and I don't paint them very often but when I do I love to just sit down when I've got time without Freddie, pamper myself and this is my favourite autumn colour and it is again a lovely dark berry kind of colour. Beautiful! I also like to um, do some kind of Halloween designs which I've done some there last year. Just get creative, really. Question three, what is your favourite Starbucks flavour autumn drink? What is your favourite autumn flavour Starbucks drink? Now, I don't tend to drink from Starbucks. I tend to go to Costa, and mine would be, like most people's, the gingerbread latte. It is scrumptious. Question four, what is your favourite autumn candle. Now mine's more of a wintry candle. Um, I don't like sweet scents like the gingerbread and the toffees and apple, toffee apples and that kind of thing. So I'm more of a spice kind of girl and mine would be the Warm Winter Hug by Glade. Now I have got this in a candle form, a wax melt form and the puffy spray kind of form. And it is amazing. Oh, I could literally eat it. It is apple, cinnamon and nutmeg. And it is just <clears throat> delicious. Question five. What is your favourite autumn accessory? Now mine would have to be my dressing gown. As soon as it gets colder, this is out. This is kind of old now. And I have requested from Santa a new dressing gown for Christmas. But I... It's when I'm out in the cold weather, I can't wait to get back to a hot bath and my dressing gown. Dressing gown. Um, question six. Haunted house, haunted hayride or haunted corn maze. Now, we don't really have a haunted hayride or haunted corn maze here in England. It's more of an American thing. But haunted house is right up my street. I love anything scary. To be honest, I don't really get scared, but um, Haunted House, me and my twin sister have been looking into going to one of these for years, and we must go. Bam, we must go. Um, so yeah, I'd pick Haunted House. Question seven, what is your favourite Halloween movie? Mine would have to be Hocus Pocus. I've watched this probably every year since it came out in 1993, I think. Um, and it never gets boring. I absolutely love it. Even though when you watch it now, you can tell it's a very old film. Question eight. What is your favourite sweet to eat at Halloween? I love them little skulls that are made of white chocolate, but they're pink and white. Love them. And also the traditional toffee apple and toffee. My mum used to make toffee, um, like little broken up bits of toffee. So yeah, they're my favourite sweets at Halloween. Just sweets, really. I mean, 
we used to have bags and bags of sweets. It's not so much anymore. Not as many people do trick or treat, and you have to have a pumpkin outside your house now if you are okay with people knocking. But we used to come home with bags that last us months of sweets. Um, so yeah, sweets, just any sweets. Number nine, what are you dressing up for at Halloween? I haven't got a Halloween party to go to this year, so I don't doubt I'll be dressing up. I will, however, be taking Freddy trick-or-treating only because I take my nieces every year and they're older and appreciate Halloween. Um, and I may as well take Freddy along. He is dressing up as a Dracula and I can't wait to see him in the little outfit. Um, we are also doing a little photo shoot between um, me and my group of girls because we've all got children between the age of um, newborn and two and a half. Uh, that would be lovely, just get them all together in their little outfits and take some pictures. Um, question 10, final question. What is your favourite thing about Halloween and autumn? It's got to be just that cosy, homey feel. When you, you get home, put your dressing gown on, your new PJs, you put candles on a, a movie, get your hot chocolate or your coffee and just get all cosy. I love it. Um, there's no other time of the year that it's better to be at home, have a night in, and just wrap up with your blanket. So yeah, um, there are all the questions for this autumn tag. Sorry if you girls have been tagged already, but I tag Sammy Bird and Just Saying Mum. Hope you enjoyed the video today, guys. Give it a thumbs up if you have. Click subscribe and the little bell to notify you of all our future videos. Bye!